A lot of predictions out here, and most of them have come true. But understand, it's nothing mystical. It's about observations and educated guesses based on facts and logic. Now, in 2016, I made one of those predictions, and I stand by that prediction, but I never had any idea how long it would take. But make no mistake, it's going to come true. Now, in 2016, when Donald Trump was elected president of the United States, I said at some point, Donald Trump will do something so stupid or so egregious that the Republican Party would step away from him, leave him by the side of the curb. And let's be honest, he did a lot of those things. His four-year presidency was absolutely horrific. He was impeached twice. He was negligent in COVID, and a million Americans died. And then he capped it off with an attack on our U.S. Capitol, an attempted coup, an insurrection, if you will. Surely, one of those things, all of those things, would have gotten the Republicans to step back and say, enough is enough. But that wasn't enough. That wasn't enough at all. And then after he's out of office, he continues the rhetoric, inciting violence. He's indicted twice with more to come. And still, that's not enough. As we look at the Republican Party, Donald Trump leads the candidates for the Republican nominee for the presidential election in 2024. Still, still they back him up. Now, there will be some Republicans say that we don't support that. Let me tell you what the Republican Party is made up of. You've got the small section of crazy MAGA fucks. And the rest are just a bunch of cowards that are afraid of MAGA and allow MAGA to control everything. So everybody in the Republican Party is culpable for what's going on in this country. Now, here's what you've got to understand. My prediction will ultimately come true, albeit seven years, maybe eight years after the fact. What Donald Trump is going to go through in the next 16 months, he cannot survive. He will not survive. Donald Trump will go down. The Republicans will still stand behind him up until the point of the 2024 elections. In the 2024 elections, logic tells me that the Republicans are going to get wiped out. There's too much bad going on for the Republicans between now and then. And after that election, and then and only then, will the Republicans say, oh, we fucked up. This ain't working. Let's kick Donald Trump to the curb. Let's change everything. But the people that stood by Donald Trump and this ideology of the Republican Party all these years will fall by the wayside. If the Republican Party hopes to survive, they're going to have to wipe away virtually everybody in the party, change their ideology and then ultimately rehabilitate their image. But that will take forever. I'm going to make another prediction. The Republicans will finally step away from Donald Trump and kick him to the curb, but it will be too late. Because what we're seeing now is the demise of the entire Republican Party. And they're doing it willfully. They know it's coming, but they are too afraid to change it. Over the next 18 months, 16 months, Donald Trump will go down. So will the people around him. And then the Republican Party will fail ultimately. And after then, and only then, it will be impossible for them to recover in any short period of time. It's going to take five or 10 years. We're watching a Republican Party with a terminal illness. We're on a death watch now for the Republican Party. That's the only way it can go. That's what facts and logic tell us. So if you're nervous now, don't worry, it's coming. It'll take some time, but make no mistake, it's coming.